Far too many things to know and too little time. And I am coming to surprise this guy that I really, really like. And I thought that we're together, but I also think he's sleeping with another girl. So he thinks I'm coming in Tuesday. I am five minutes away from his house. So what are you supposed to do whenever someone comes and compliments you and the guy that you really like and are dating and say, oh, you two are such a cute couple. Is it, you're such a hot boyfriend. And he's like, oh yeah, no, we're not boyfriend and girlfriend. I'm pretty sure you're not fucking anyone else, I hope, and I'm not fucking anyone else. So, what are we? I looked at him like a friend, and I thought that's what it was. But he thought that I was gonna fuck him. Smalls, you're killing me. I stopped going to your place because you said no. What the? Ah, you're driving me crazy. <sighs> Hurry up and decide, yes or no? Because it, it really determines my whole day. Please, come on, you're being difficult. <laughs> But then it's like, I feel, I feel as if like the, the more he pushes me away into that deep oblivion, right? Mm -hmm. That eventually I'm just going to fade away. Yeah, exactly that. And if he's, hopefully he realizes before it's too late that he needs to fucking make that move on it. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's a ch that chess game, you gotta, that's a big move. It's like, look, either you're going to fucking keep searching you know, you're like, oh, well, I found this chick that I really dig and we really get along. We're fucking, everything's great with it. But I'm fucking gonna fucking test it. But what if it's not her? You know, he's not probably at that. What if it's not her? What about, let me, let me look around and see what I can find. Don't tell me what to do. You're not the boss of me. Ugh.